Hi, Lori. It's a great pleasure to have you in our community. How are you today? I am great. Uh, thank you so much for having me. I, I will start with um, I, my current specialty is working with people with long COVID, uh, so long haulers, to help them to navigate the illness and to manage it. And I'm so passionate about this because of my own story. So I'll, I'll go into that um, since you mentioned it. So right out of college, in my 20s, I was pursuing acting and I was getting, uh, I was getting some traction. You know, I was going to auditions with big stars and for blockbuster productions and things like that and getting good feedback. And, uh, and one day I was on a film set. I wasn't acting on the film set, but I was on a film set and I actually collapsed. Um, I hadn't been feeling well for a while, but they said, if you don't come, <laughs> then you're fired. So, so I went and I collapsed on set, had to be, you know, it was a very dramatic thing. I had to be taken away by an ambulance to the hospital. And in the hospital, they told me that I had gotten dehydrated because we were working on the beach in Southeastern US in, you know, very, very hot weather. And so that's what I believed. Uh, but eight years later, when I was still housebound and bedbound a good bit of the time, <laughs> it was not dehydration. So what I learned probably a couple of years into it, really, was that I had something called myalgic encephalomyelitis, also known as chronic fatigue syndrome, along with fibromyalgia. So if you're not familiar with these things, what it means for a lot of people, and it varies, it varies because it's a syndrome, right? So it has lots of different components that not everybody has, and they don't know what it is. They don't know why you have it. So they just lump it all together and call it a syndrome. Um, so I went to dozens of doctors, traveled for hours and hours to go to specialists, uh, spent tens of thousands of dollars on medicine and which usually, which always actually made me feel worse and supplements. I even tried dried worm supplements at some point because that was supposed to help with autoimmune issues. It did not. Um, so because when you're that desperate, when you go from running, you know, three to five miles, three times a week and being very active and, uh, especially when you're ready to launch a career, you know, to get out there in the world, you're willing to try anything and everything. You know, I was, I was in the place where a lot of times my father had to feed me because I couldn't lift my hand. Um, my boyfriend at the time had to sometimes carry me to the bathroom because I couldn't get there on my own. So, uh, yeah, so after, you know, these years and years of searching for an answer and just not finding one, I started looking to alternatives, to alternative medicine, to, uh, yeah, to things that I had control over. And... So I, I started studying these things and I started developing strategies and tools of how to not feel as bad, you know, and, and what I noticed was that I did start to very, 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 very slowly make progress by using these tools, by using these strategies. Some of them I came up with on my own and others, um, I learned from, you know, other, other modalities, other people. But what I ended up with at the end was a very comprehensive way of approaching this thing. 
And so I, st- I started working with clients. Um, I've been working with clients with these types of illnesses for almost 20 years now, which is crazy to me. But uh, yeah, but with very good success. So, so with, and, and my, my clients and students have been asking me for, for years to create an online course that they could take with all this stuff, because this has all been one-on-one and uh, yeah. So they've been asking that for a while. And then when long COVID, I mean, when, when COVID hit and now people are having long COVID, including me, (laughs) though I, I have a very mild, very mild case of it. But, um, you know, it really lit a fire for me because pe- because it's so confusing and scary and disheartening and depressing and anxiety inducing in addition to everything that's happening in the world, you know, but it, it feels like you're in a completely different body and it feels like your body's turned on you. So that lit a fire for me to, to, uh, create this program for people and uh, uh Lori, you mentioned that you have an online course so how that works how how long it takes and let people know how they can enroll and how they can find more information yeah so i would recommend going to my website it's living from inspiration.com and then at the top there is a, a place that says uh, i think it's called long covid uh, recovery support course and you can click on that and then within that page there's a place where you can enter your email to get on the wait list um, and what that's going to do for you as well is it's going to put you on the mailing list that I have and you're going to find uh, videos that I'm going to be sending out that I do send out Uh, Sometimes yoga videos, because one of the things that's really tricky about long COVID is being physically active without causing a crash, what we call a crash, which puts you in bed for the next couple of days or weeks or months, even if you do just a teeny fraction of Mm -hmm. what you used to be able to do physically or even in your everyday life. You know, sometimes being on a phone call for or 10 or 15 minutes can cause a crash for people. Uh, so yeah, they can go there. I also just created a, uh, a video that's about 45 minutes long. It's called Three Keys to Avoiding Crashes. Mm-hmm. And that's really helpful. That's going to get you started. Uh, it's, it's a super concentrated version of some of the main things that we go through in the course. So you can sign up for that as well. I think I need to put a link for that up on the on the website. But yeah, go to the website, sign up for the newsletter um, through that, or sign up for the wait list, and you'll get yeah you'll get on that mailing list. And I know you also teach the course uh, Money Is and Plenty and Love Yourself. So can you share about that course as well? Yes, and I'm really excited about those too. You know, I, it's funny because. Because one of my favorite things to teach is arm balances and inversions because I'm a yoga teacher as well, but I can't teach those right now. (laughs) So I went, all right, what else am I really passionate about? And, uh, you know, abundance and prosperity and money. These are things that, that we can get super tangled up about and they don't have to be so difficult. So. So that course is going to be launching the money ease and plenty. The official version of it is going to be in the spring Mm -hmm. and it's going to include probably four live calls and then uh, also some pre-recorded material, which is the same thing that the long COVID course is. Uh, But the long COVID course is actually because I didn't answer that earlier. So the long COVID course is, uh, eight weeks, six to eight weeks. And then it also includes a bunch of pre-recorded stuff, bonuses, one of which is 
a, a calendar that you can follow with links to videos to yoga classes and strength training uh, to allow you to exercise in a way that's not going to cause a crash and to avoid muscle wasting because that does start to happen after you know several months of not being able to be physically active so uh yeah and then the uh the love yourself course mm -hmm. i'm very excited about as well that's going to be out around valentine's day and it's going to be exercises to get to know yourself better and to be able to be unconditionally loving of yourself you know we I think we all have tendencies to try to be perfect and there's so much uh, joy and richness in embracing the messed up parts of ourselves, you know? So, so those are things that we're going to be exploring. And then there's an option with that as well to do some, some yoga, but that's not um, a necessity. And uh, Lori, for creating those courses, you mentioned uh, you have a, a mailing list. Do you have also your community, online community, where people can uh, follow you and engage with your content? Like a yes. Facebook? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm working on getting that more uh, in place because I'm focusing more right now on creating these courses and mm -hmm. getting people on the road to feeling better. Um, but yeah, if they want to look me up on Facebook, there's a lot of activity there. Instagram, not quite as much, mm -hmm. but, uh, they can find my page. You can just look up Laurie Rivers Yoga and Laurie is spelled L-O-R-R-I-E Rivers mm -hmm. Yoga. And that'll take you to my page. Yeah. Yeah. And, and in that course, we address emotional health, emotional intelligence. We address mm -hmm. physiological things. We address it's the it's the whole thing. I'm a holistic life coach. Holistic. So we, we address all of it. Thank you so much. And I invite all people who are watching this interview and video who find themselves in a difficult situation of illness. Take a look, uh, sign up on the Lori email. Uh, check uh, her courses this is something we really have to to think about how to take that responsibility of our life and our health again thank you so much and i hope you will have many uh, students who will find the benefits who will be on position where you are now and uh, that's a great impact and uh, yeah, it's a it's a pleasure to have you in community thank you it's a pleasure to be in the community and i i appreciate it so much and for all of you guys who watch this video, please uh, like, subscribe, share with the people who you think might have benefits from. And thank you for watching us and see you soon. Thank you, Laurie. Thank you one more time.